guys, Tiffany here and welcome to Our Organic Life and welcome to Farm Fresh Friday. So every Friday I'm going to be starting to share with you recipes that are farm fresh. You can either get source the majority of the ingredients from farmers markets or from your own garden or homestead or farm. So today we are going to be making a really delicious salad. Now if you are not a salad eater, I apologize in advance. This is not what Farm Fresh Friday is going to be. I just was making my lunch and I thought I would share this really delicious recipe. I used to suck at making salads until, so this is kind of something that I've come up with over the years and I love it. It's delicious, it's refreshing, it is kind of like a balance between sweet and tangy and it is just so good. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment down below if you like this recipe. Also, the ingredients for this recipe are going to be in the description down below. So, let's get to it. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna prepare my leafy greens. I'm using two different types of varieties. I'm using a romaine heart and then just a simple spring mix. Just to show you guys this cool trick that I learned actually on TikTok is uh, to have quickly, a quick way to remove the heart of your romaine. So basically you just kind of pull it firmly and you and the heart just comes out and you got all your lettuce like this i'm sorry you might already know this was a thing but i didn't know it was a thing and i thought it was really really cool and so and we can even just snap off if you want those little bits but that's quick so i'm going to go ahead and get these washed as well as my spring mix okay, now these are washed now no judging i am not a chef i just like to eat good food so we're going to go ahead and start chopping this Now some people will leave it like that. I like my lettuce a little bit smaller and easier for me to uh, get a mouthful and not just like trying to cram my mouth over huge leaves of lettuce. So we're gonna keep this simple. I've got my salad bowl. I got this from a Habitat for Humanity store. I absolutely love it. It is a stoneware. Unfortunately, I don't know the uh, company or the brand but it is just so cute and I love the design on it so we're gonna go ahead and add in our romaine heart and I've got my spring mix basically any kind of mixed baby greens would be perfect just to add some different texture different flavors and we're gonna go ahead and chop this up just like we did the romaine I just love the color of the spring mix. It's got so it is hot in Florida, so you definitely need something refreshing in your salad. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a cucumber. Again, not a chef. I apologize for my atrocious cutting skills. And then I'm just gonna cut these into smaller bites. So it's easier to pick up with my fork mix in with the salad. And then from here it is a run to the finish. We're going to top this with some feta. Then to balance the tartness I like to add a handful of raisins. Then for our protein I roasted some turkey for dinner the other night and so I just shredded that up and have been using it for my salad all week. Now this could be it if you like a dry salad. I personally like to have a little bit of a dressing on my salad so I'm going to also share with you guys how to make a super easy zesty Italian dressing to put on it. You could of course use a store bought one but why not try and make something with what you got and it's got less ingredients and it's cleaner for you and you know what you're eating. So this is a super simple dressing recipe which you're gonna need is of course a mason jar, three-fourths of a cup of extra virgin olive oil. It's gonna give it the best taste and won't be too strong. Then you're going to need an acid and you can use a red wine vinegar or a white wine vinegar. I personally am using a white wine vinegar with half and half with a uh, apple cider vinegar with the mother. 
Now I'm simplifying it, I just have some an Italian seasoning mix, but you could use if you have fresh um, herbs you, or dried herbs that you've stored, you would want one teaspoon of dried basil, one teaspoon of dried parsley, and one teaspoon of dried oregano. But I am just going to use a tablespoon, which is the equivalent of Italian dressing. I mean, Italian seasoning. Then you are going to want to use garlic. Now you can use dried garlic. I'm using fresh. Um, if you're using dried garlic, you're going to want to use three-fourths of a teaspoon of garlic powder. Um, but I'm just going to use some garlic and I'm just going to measure that with my heart because that's what you do. Then you are going to want to add something sweet to balance the acidic ingredient. So you're going to use a teaspoon or more of honey. Whatever you want. How much you want if you like it a little sweet. Then you want a little salt and a little pepper to taste. And then to finish it up, you're going to add two tablespoons of Parmesan cheese. We're going to put a lid on it, give it a nice little shake, and there you go, your zesty Italian dressing. Now you can refrigerate this and store it for, I believe, a week. I am going to just drizzle this over top. Mm, it smells amazing. As a bonus, if you like to have some crunch in your salad but don't want to have croutons, I've got some chopped walnuts that I'm going to just add in. And there you have it. And there you have it. Look at that. That just looks delicious. So you might not be a salad person. I'm sorry if you are not. This is not going to be a whole bunch of salads. My Farm Fresh Fridays is going to be more than that. I was just making this for lunch and I thought, you know what, this would be an excellent recipe because I used to suck at making salads and uh, I love this salad. This is actually really, really good. So I actually crave this on a regular basis. And this doesn't have to be like, a, this could be lunch for yourself or you could even serve this as a side to dinner. Um, it could be used in many different ways. It doesn't just have to be just a salad. So I hope you guys enjoy this. I'm going to keep sharing these. Leave a comment down below if there's any specific ingredients that you guys want to see in recipes. Um, if you want more breakfast, lunch, dinner recipes, let me know. If you want some healthier dessert options, let me know as well. Just leave down in the comment the kind of things that you were wanting to see in Farm Fresh Fridays. I hope you guys enjoyed this because I know I am about to be enjoying this. Mm-hmm. I have gone.